All right, everyone, happy Saturday. Now to finish off the week strong, we are going to get a shoulder and arm pump workout today. So the first thing we're going to do is start off with our full stationary warm up as always, 10 squats, five lunges per side, crossovers for five per side, high leg kicks, 10 per side, rolling V-sits for 10, 15 fire hydrants, 15 glute bridges, 15 spiders, and 15 hip unders, right? After that, you're gonna grab a micro band and we're going to get three rounds of three different exercises. Our first one is going to be a band pull apart for 25 repetitions. The next one, palms are supinated up to the sky, elbows are tight, we're gonna get 25 external rotations here. And the last one, we're going to get 15 of a banded overhead press. What we're going to do is step into the band like so, bring the band up and over your clavicles like this, place the band outside of the arms like so. Keep the elbows tight, we're pressing overhead, and then back down here, we are going to get 15 overhead presses like so. So 25 pull apart, 25 external rotations, and 15 banded overhead presses. Pause the video here, get the work done, I will see you here for our part A section. All right, everyone, for our B section, you're going to need a pair of light dumbbells, a bumper plate. If you don't have it, you can use a dumbbell for that and a pair of heavier dumbbells here. So for our first thing, we're going to do a overhead raise into a press. So what we're going to do is scoop our pelvis in, keep the plate down our body here. We're going to raise overhead like so, bring it down to our clavicle and then press overhead and then bring it back down to our quad. So once again, raise overhead, press overhead and then bring it back down here that is one repetition you have 10. once you are done there we're going to grab the light pair of dumbbells we're going to go into a lateral hold here for 10 deep breaths in your nose out your mouth is one you have 10 deep breaths here the last exercise is going to be a shrug so you're going to grab a, a set of heavier dumbbells roll your shoulders back and you're bringing your uh, shoulders up to your ears that is one. So remember, roll your shoulders back, shrug up to your ears here. You have 15 repetitions. So once again, three rounds, a overhead raise into a press for 10 repetitions, our lateral hold here with the light pair of dumbbells for 10 breaths, and our shrugs, pulling the shoulder blades back and up to our shoulders for 15 repetitions. Pause the video here, get your all three rounds done, and meet me here for part C. All right, now everyone, for our C section, we are going to grab a pair, one dumbbell, a band, I'm using a micro band, and I'm gonna have that band up there, the green band for my push downs. So for our one dumbbell exercise, we're gonna grab the dumbbell, cup it in between our hands here, so now it's forming like a triangle. We're gonna curl up to the chest and back down here. Squeeze at the top with the uh, bicep, come back down, we have 10 waiter curls here. Once we're done with our waiter curls, drop the dumbbell, grab your band. We have rotating curls here. So palms starting in, come up, back down. We have 15 to 20 rotating curls here. Once you're done with that, drop the band, go to your band that's overhead. We have 15 to 20 banded push downs here. Make sure we're firing and extending through that elbow down to the ground. We have 15 to 20. Once again, three rounds, 10 waiter curls with the dumbbell here, rotating band curls with the micro band or red band, whichever you prefer, and then push downs for 15 to 20 repetitions, all right? Pause the video here. We're going to move on to our last section and then we're all done for today. All right, everyone. Now for our D section, it is a 10 minute EMOM. What that means is every minute on the minute, you are performing a set of exercises. We have three exercises. Each exercise is going to be performed for five repetitions. So say it takes me 30 seconds to perform the three exercises at five repetitions each. It takes me 30 seconds to rest before the start of the, uh, the next minute, uh, the, the next round, right? So 30 seconds of work if it takes you that long, 30 seconds of rest, and then back up to the top to the next round. So what the exercises are going to be is going to be a kettlebell squat. So you're going to grab a kettlebell, high plank, a uh, high rack position, squat for five repetitions. We are then going to go for five kettlebell swings here. And the last one is a kettlebell head cutter. I know it sounds scary. It really isn't what that looks like. You're going to grab a kettlebell, start here, come up and switch your hands to underneath here. So once again, start down, switch to underneath like so, squat down again, and then fire your head through bicep or in line with the ears here. 
and then you're gonna come back down and repeat that same motion. So squat down, switch your hands to underhand, squat down again, and fire through, head in line with the ears, or head in line with the bicep, and that is also for five repetitions, right? So five squats, five swings, and five kettlebell head cutters. Once you're done with your 10 minute EMOM there, guys, we are all done for today. Thank you for joining me in this week. I hope everyone had a great week, all right? And I'll see you until the next time.